And now to a WPBF 25 News exclusive. A Port St. Lucie man charged with murdering his two year old foster son is no stranger to child abuse allegations. Michael Beer was also accused of beating up a child back in 1993 in Palm Beach County. Ari Height got his hands on that sheriff's office report. When police arrested Michael Beer and charged him with killing his foster child, two year old Tristan Adams, they said he had been accused but not charged in a similar crime the brutal beating of another two year old, this one in Palm Beach County in 1993. The other two year old didn't matter. That other baby, that innocent baby, didn't matter. Now, now it had to take my, my life away. WPBF 25 News has exclusively obtained the police report from that 1993 investigation. The child's name is blacked out, but the investigator says she had, quote, bruises on her right ear, left lower leg, forehead, right eye, bruises on her back area, and a lump on the top of her head with an approximate one to one and a half inches of hair missing. It goes on to say she had a leg fracture and a skull fracture. In their investigation, police interviewed a number of people, including the girl's mother and her boyfriend, Michael Beer, only 27 years old at the time. The report indicates Beer was always, quote, around, unquote, when the girl was injured. But Beer told police it was all child playing related. Some of his explanations? The girl jerked backward and hit the sofa with possibly her right eye. He saw her fall down for no reason. She fell off the couch, striking her head. She walked into the door at day school. He said the missing hair came out when he combed it. The report says at no time did Beer or the girl's mother seek medical attention for the girl's injuries, not for the bruises, not for the leg fracture, not for the skull fracture. The investigator looked into every claim and determined Beer and his girlfriend were telling the truth. Quote, the injuries of the child sustained appeared to be accidental. The girl was sent to her father in Pennsylvania. No charges were ever filed. That was Ari Height reporting. Palm Beach County Sheriff's detectives were asked to reopen the case just a few days ago. The report says the statute of limitations has expired and therefore the case will not be reinvestigated.